what's up guys today we're on doe run lake it's winter pools so the lake is about 20 feet lower than normal air temperatures in the 40s water temp is 39 and a half it's a cold day so since it's winter pool and the water level is a lot lower there's a lot of hidden cover and structure that's now exposed so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go around with my sonar and I'm gonna pull up on some of this hidden structure and cover and I'm gonna go ahead and mark it and uh, hopefully it'll hold fish during the summer so maybe a cool little trick maybe these are some of the hidden goodies that I'm talking about this is a stump field on a point that's normally in 15 to 20 foot of water awesome little spot Here's another cool spot. Normally this is in 30 foot of water, but it's an un underwater hump. I'm going to go ahead and mark that on my hummingbird. Guys, dough run's not working out. It's windy, it's cold. Then I'm going to fish the Ohio River on Sunday, tomorrow. Uh, water temps are dropping and water levels are rising. Getting my workout in today. All I had to do is go from there to here, but it's all wet mud. And I keep sliding back down the hill in my poor shoes. Whew. This is rough. What's up guys? We're out on the Gunpowder Creek off the Ohio River. Yesterday's video didn't go so well. I couldn't catch any fish out of no run. I did get to manage to uh, drop some waypoints, you know, and prepare for next year. You know, spring and summertime when the water levels come back up. So today is even colder than yesterday. Mid uh, 30 degree air temp. Water temp looks like it's in about the same place as yesterday, 39 degrees or so. Uh, water visibility is actually not too bad for the Ohio River, so that's kind of encouraging. So we're going to get out here, we're going to grab around and try to find where these fish are schooling up and then we're going to sit on them and just throw bait after bait after bait at them until we get something to work. So, so far I've had two big fish hooked. I'm assuming they're carp, because that's a carp scale, but they'll be fun to catch, I don't mind comes to the Ohio River, I am not picky. I'm going to take whatever I can get. But these fish don't want to play, so we're going to move to the mouth of the creek in the Ohio. Which was my original game plan, but I keep getting distracted by all the fish I'm seeing on the sonar. Ugh.
Alright guys, I fished for like three or four hours and not a single bite. I foul hooked a couple carp, but they got off. And I didn't even catch it on camera. So eh. It's getting super cold. I haven't been able to feel my toes for like the last hour. So I think it's time to go. Ah, that's fishing for you. I'm sorry I didn't catch any fish. I really wanted to. <clears throat> Fishing the Ohio River is a lot of fun just because you don't know what kind of species you're going to run into. I was hoping I would run into some white bass or some hybrid or some sauger or something. But, I don't know. This creek doesn't seem to be holding game fish. Mainly just a lot of carp and bait. So this, this, uh, this creek probably is no good for the rest of the winter. I'm going to have to find a different one to fish off of. Oh well. Alright guys, tune in next time. Hopefully I catch the fish, alright? See ya!